Hey guys, it's Terry, Gloom's boyfriend. She's not home right now, but I have an idea. She's never met my stepbrother. Out of my entire family, she's met everybody except for him. So I've hired an actor to come over when I'm not home and talk to her about stuff that only a brother would know. And I've told him to relate to her on some stuff that I hate that she likes, like the gym and astrology, which is the dumbest thing ever. And I wish she didn't like it, but she does. So I've set up some cameras around the house. He's gonna come over and and we're gonna see what happens, I guess. She loves me, right? She was not gonna fall for this guy. This guy? Probably not, but we'll see. Oh, uh, so I'm so I'm so sorry. Hi. So sorry. I'm uh, I don't know if Terry told you I was coming. I'm Adam. Oh, hi. Terry's brother. Lexi, yeah. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. <laughs> he had to get some stuff from the from the grocery store. Okay. Yeah. Do you mind I'm if I, do you mind if I yeah, said, no, absolutely. This is a really nice house. Thank really you. nice place you guys got. Yeah, better than Terry's old places. <laughs> yeah. The cockroaches and everything. Did you ever stay there? Yeah, I stayed a few times. Man, I told him so many times, don't let girls stay there when there's bed bugs. Does he listen to me? He does not. Oh, oh you're fine. You're fine. He's okay. not. It was years, years ago. We've been together for five years. Yeah, you guys got a you guys got a gym in this place by any chance? We do, we do. It's uh, it's up two floors. Sweet, yeah. sweet, sweet. I've been trying to get into working out, but like Terry's not like super into it. And... Yeah, Terry has never worked out. No, Terry employs the gym of life. You know, does like a hundred and fifty pound deadlift out of bed every morning. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, I do real deadlifts. I'm a big runner. Really? You know, yeah, I like to do marathons, stuff like that. Wow. My rule is break ten sweats a day. You know. Ten. Well, I mean, that's something for me to aspire to. It, it's funny, um, Terry, when we were kids, mm -hmm. I would always go to the gym mm -hmm. and then he would kind of come along with me and say that he was going to go every single time. And then he would just go to the gym and he'd just be one of those guys that just walks around, you know, the weight room floor. That is exactly what he does. And that's what he does, right? He goes, but then he just walks around the whole time. But he told me that like he used to go all the time when he was little. Well, he would go to walk around. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <sighs> When's your birthday? December 19th. I knew that you were a Sagittarius. I don't often meet people who can like say astrology signs off the cuff like that. Do you actually like believe in that kind of stuff? Because like I do, but Terry thinks it's weird. I don't believe in it. I, I, I know it. Do you believe in math? I mean, good point. You know it. Yeah. How did you get into it? Long story short, I was at a conference in Tibet oh. at the foothills of the Palhuzye Mountains. I was in a sea of thousands. And a monk, a master guru, really. He looked at me in the eyes. My body started to shake, started to feel open, started to feel free. He said, Taoli Wada, which means follow in my footsteps, my son. And you understood. And I understood I was his prodigy. Sorry, it's an emotional. It's an emotional story for me to tell. How long did you stay? About six months until my visa was denied. Really? Yeah. I don't tell that to a lot of people. That's weird. Well, I'm so happy you shared it with me. It's like, I can't believe you're Terry's brother. Like, we have so much in common. Like, I know. where did you come from? Milwaukee. <laughs> oh. Mm hmm Yeah. Kind of a long flight. Yeah. Stinky plane. Stinky plane? So I would love, um... Sorry, I... Don't sit. Take your breath. Relax. I just want to take a shower, you know? Okay. I did a core blast this morning, and my abs are feeling a little cramped, and so I would just love to wash some soapy hot water all over them, just to make sure that they remain soft. Is that okay? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, do you need me to show you where the yeah. shower, <laughs> shower is? Okay, yeah, we'll, we'll take you. We'll get you. Thank we'll you get so you much. Adam, huh? That's me. Hey, Cassie. Y yeah? There's just no towels in here. Oh my goodness, I'm so sorry. I'll bring one over right away. Yeah, just, just, just bring it right on in. Right.
right on it. I can I can do that. Are you sure I can, I can just leave it up here if you'd like? Yeah, just go ahead. Okay. <laughs> All right. Gotcha! <laughs> This is not Adam, it's actually Gabe. He's an actor and I hired him to just mess with you, I guess. <laughs> oh, uh, you're a really good actor. Thanks, yeah. You're really good at getting pumped. Uh, thanks. <laughs> We're all good at things! <laughs> you should stay for dinner, man. That was awesome. Yeah, sure, that sounds good. Right on. I would love to. Okay. This is great. How's your guys's? Fantastic. I mean, you're a wonderful chef. Thank you. Mm. Yeah. I really wish you could try some, Terry. Oh, yeah, it's a shame there wasn't enough, but you know, uh, I got my Michelinas. You know, I, I don't I don't really know how you eat those things, you know? Yeah. There's just just so much fat and sodium and maltodextrin. Oh, maltodextrin's like the best. You Church read the Church. nutrition facts. I do. Yeah. I'm really into health. Me too. Really? Well, you know, I have this saying. If I can't pronounce it, I won't eat it. Words to live by. Words to live by. Terry, could you just go get me some cumin? I would love to just sprinkle it all over. On top of that? Yeah, and yeah. If you if you yeah, have any, no, you need to search for an that. extended period of time. That's fine. It's in the cupboard. Okay, listen. Huh? I hate cumin. All okay. right. Yeah, I just got him away so that I could tell you. I have a proposal for you. All right. I'm attractive. I know it. You certainly know it. All right. Mm -hmm. There's a cafe in Paris called Je Puis Du Bois. There is a man there named Jacques. Okay, he is waiting with a bottle of Bordeaux with my name on it. Soon to have your name on it. And if you would like, I will take you to. Okay. Here we go. Yeah. Oh, thank oh, you yes. so much for the cumin. And I hate to be a diva, <laughs> but could I just could I just get a glass of water with three and a half ice cubes in it, please? Uh, half? A half. Just cut it. Just cut. Just, just cut, cut it. it. Just cut it. Yeah. Okay. If you would like to stay in Paris tonight with me under the Tour du Fel, okay? Wake up, have a croissant, maybe three. Here's what you're gonna do. You're going to clink your glass with your knife and I will immediately, shamelessly, get up from this table and I will walk out the front door, okay? And I will be waiting for you there, hand and foot with two plane tickets. One with your name on it, one with my name on it. I actually found a half cube. Oh my, my god. So oh, I didn't look have at to that. cut it at all. Thank you so yeah, much. No problem. Mm. It's nice. I just want to make a toast because. <laughs> Gabe, you really like stuck your neck out for me. You walked into the house when Cassie was just there by herself. Could be pretty dangerous. Yeah. And uh, and I think the video is going to be great. So, y juice, you know what? Toast. You know that was beautiful. I also uh, I also have a toast. Sure. I would like to make a toast to the French, okay. the people of France, sure. for their goods and their rich, rich, vibrant history. French fries. <laughs> also that. Cheers. C Cassie, do you have anything you want to say? No, I think I'm okay no, for now. I just... You know, you know, to start a toast, you just... <laughs> it's actually fun. It's that's, fun. That's like half the reason I did it. Uh, actually, I think I'm I think I'm going to clean, clean up a little bit. It's getting kind of late. It is getting late. Okay, uh, okay, uh, I will see you, and I will definitely be seeing you soon, and, uh, voila! Okay, yeah. woo! See you, man. Yeah. Bye. You know, it's kind of a good thing you left, because I've been holding something in. What's that? Game! Game! Yes, she thought of a toast.